All right, y'all, it's time to test out the iPhone 11. I'm here in Austin at Kino Kinia. <laughs> Took me like eight times to practice like how to pronounce the actual store name. But this store has a lot of cool trinkets from Japan and around the world. It's got pens, pencils, things to dangle from your phone and stuff. Right now I'm using the iPhone 11 ultra wide camera. And I'm gonna be switching off between the ultra wide and the wide angle camera. So far, I really dig this camera. The stabilization looks really awesome. But let's step in the store and check out what this camera is capable of and also look at a bunch of cool stuff. Alright, so checking out some of this footage, I can definitely say the ultra wide is not messing around. It's definitely ultra wide. It gives you a really nice view of your surroundings and the microphone quality I think is actually pretty cool. This camera records audio in stereo. One thing you do have to be aware of though is it is an ultra wide lens. So right now I have my face to the camera about maybe one foot away. So you gotta be really mindful of where you place your hand because the closer you place your hand, to the lens, the more your hand might actually be in the frame. And also your arm will be really distorted and look really weird. But the quality looks amazing. The stabilization looks amazing on here. They're not messing around with their cinematic stabilization. I can attest to that. One thing I also really like about the ultra wide lens is because it is so ultra wide, you don't have to hold your phone like all the way out like this just to get your entire face and body in the frame. You can just hold it out maybe about a foot away from the camera and you get a nice wide view without breaking your elbow and arm. You can actually be pretty close to the lens and it still looks like a nice wide field of view. See your surroundings, that's pretty cool. I've been shooting for about an hour and Apple was talking about how this phone has like the craziest battery, excuse me, sorry. <laughs> Apple's saying how this phone has like 2.8 times the battery life of a chameleon squirrel or something like that. So okay, so I've been shooting on this phone for about an hour now in 4K, 24 frames per second. Just check my phone and the battery is at 86%. That's pretty amazing, especially when shooting in 4K. Like if I was using one of my like camera cameras, the battery would probably be already down after about an hour. Actually, I don't even know if it would last one hour. So now that you've seen a bunch of tests with the rear facing cameras on the iPhone 11, let me know what you think in the comments. I'm pretty impressed with the quality overall. I think the colors look really good. The autofocus is really good especially on the wide angle lens, not the ultra wide, but the wide angle lens. The ultra wide kind of focuses on everything because the aperture isn't as wide. You can't really get bokeh with the ultra wide angle, but it's not really meant for that. But you can definitely get bokeh with the normal wide angle, not the ultra wide lens, but the normal wide angle lens because it has an aperture of f1.8. So if you take an object and go like this right into the camera, it'll probably do a pretty good job if you're using the wide angle lens of blurring out the background. Colors look good, sharpness is on point, of course. 
Autofocus is insane. It looks really natural. It just kind of zooms right in onto a subject and focuses really well. So no problems with autofocus. So some of you out there might be wondering, can you use the iPhone 11 as your main vlogging camera? In my opinion, absolutely yes, 100%. The audio is pretty good. Voices sound nice and present, and I like that there's the stereo audio so you can hear some of your surroundings. The video quality looks fantastic. It does suffer a little bit in low light, kind of to be expected. Right now, you know, obviously it's a nice sunny day. You can see all of the sky and everything. It just looks really pretty. So this footage is gonna be ultra sharp. The front facing camera is amazing. The rear facing cameras are amazing. The wide and the ultra wide. iPhones have always had some of the best image quality and features of almost any camera phone ever created in my opinion and the iphone 11 is definitely no slouch this looks amazing absolutely you can use this camera as your main vlogging camera what do you think about all this footage let me know in the comments did you get the iphone 11 did you get the iphone 11 pro pro max pro max 2x cube which one did you get let me know smash the like button subscribe you know what to do add me on instagram and i'll see you in the next one